Hello guys, welcome back. My name is Pravin Kumar Sriram. I'm a Microsoft Certified Trainer, author, currently working as a Solutions Architect on Azure. In our previous video, we have learned how to create Azure Key Vault using Bicep. And in case if you never worked on Key Vault, basically Key Vault is a Azure service which allows us to manage keys, secrets, and certificates. In our previous recording, we have learned how to create Key Vault. Today, we are going to learn how to create its children, wherein we can create keys as well as secrets. Let's get started. For any resource, we need to create a resource block, and here we wanted to check and create a key inside the Key Vault and Search for keys and here you go. Key vault slash walls slash keys is the one that you should choose. Pick the API, select equal to, and then required properties. It will ask you to provide a name. Maybe I will say key one. And now this is a child item of a key vault. For all child items in bicep, you need to specify the parent symbolic name. Now the symbolic name of the key vault is this. So copy the symbolic name and specify that here. And once that is done, we need to specify some properties starting with key size. Basically, this is a string. Uh, in fact, I'm sorry, it is not a string, it's a number, basically 2048. In case if you are not sure about the options, just hover on this, it will tell you it's an int. The key size in bits, basically it's for encryption. So different sizes for different algorithms. So we can choose based on the requirements. I'll go with 2048 and then the name so here we can choose the one that is required and finally type of the key or key type so i will choose one of them right these are the mandatory fields now let's save it and run it It will take some time. I'll come back once the deployment is successful. The deployment is successful. Now let's go to the portal and see if key one is created or not. As you can see, key one is created. And by default, key vault maintains versions. Currently, we have only one version. So click on this and you should see the key that we have created. Now let's create a secret similarly. For secret, you need to create another resource block. It's exactly key vault, walls, secrets. You need to provide a name. Here I'll just provide a secret one and it's giving error because we did not specify its parent. For all child resources in bicep, we need to specify the parent symbolic name. And within properties, we need to specify the value of the secret. So here a secret could be anything. Here I'm hard coding the value of the secret which is not a good practice don't use this in your real-time projects please always ensure that you are not committing the sensitive information to git and this is hard coding which will eventually go to git in your projects so here i am just showing you how to create a secrets however 
when you are working in your projects ensure that this secret is coming from a secure place okay for now let's save this file and run this for deploying the new resource i'll pause the video i'll come back once the execution is completed the deployment is successful let's navigate to azure management portal and then click on secrets we should see one secret and default version and then click on show secret value this is the secret that we have created that's it thanks for watching if you have any questions please comment i'll make sure i'll respond thank you so much bye bye